Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back. Today I want to do a little tutorial on how to do a time lapse using the new GoPro Studio 2.0. So let's get started. Um, so basically I'm importing my time lapse here. I got about 153 images. Once you have all your images imported, you want to go over to the right and actually click the add clips to the conversion list and then just click convert all. It's going to convert all those images into a single AVI file. So once that's done, proceed to step two and then just bring it down on the timeline. You could hit play and just watch your time lapse and it'll just work. It just automatically does it because like I said, it takes all those images and makes it one single AVI file, which is a video file. So then you could uh, just mess around with the colors. They have different presets. And as I said in my previous video, you can also manually adjust all the colors, the exposure, the contrast, saturation. Once you're happy with all the colors, you could also adjust the speed of the time lapse if you want it to be faster or slower. It depends on what you really want. Here I'm just slowing it down just to see how slow it'll actually go. Then I sped it up a little bit and hit play and it played a little faster, but I think I went with the 100% uh, just what it defaulted to and I was happy with that. Once you've got your video perfect, you're gonna wanna export it. I went with the preset, the YouTube preset, which is, it's saying it's 12 frames per second, full HD, 1080p, H.264, exporting it to my computer, and it's exporting pretty quick. It's not that big of a file, so, I mean, it's not gonna take forever. And it's pretty much done, so let's check it out. So yeah, it looks pretty good. So I think if you have any time lapses that you need to do, you should definitely just try out the GoPro Studio 2.0 because it's very easy to do. So that pretty much wraps up this quick video tutorial. And I just want to say thank you for watching. If you want, you can check out two of my latest videos here. And you can subscribe to stay up to date with my future videos. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.